<laughs> it's only the enders you've got to tick the box on, isn't well, it? Well, yeah, I've actually been in the Queen Vic on um, oh. what me and the children in need, so I've, I've kind of been around them all. You've kind yeah. of experienced it. Yeah. yeah. That was some time ago, the Emmerdale. You were just saying to us that it was Emmerdale Farm when you it were in it. It was Emmerdale Farm, yeah, Gosh. and I had my own hair and teeth. Then, I <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's frightening to see. That's the first time I've seen that clip in all those years. So. Goodness and me. And you've been very clever because you've kind of left it open to go back to pretty much all of those characters if you want to. Well, I've been lucky, yeah, none of them have ever killed me, but then again, none of them have ever asked me back, so, <laughs> <laughs> so who knows? But no, I mean, Corrie was just, I mean, that was a dream for me to get Corrie, because... Uh, Been a fan for you. Yeah, since I was a kid, so, as I say, walking out on the, on the cobbles for the first time was like, wow, and seeing all the faces that you've, you've seen yeah. for years, and so to be a part of that was, was magic, and... Um, who knows, see, see if they bring me back one day. I mean, you're obviously an actor, so you're doing a performance, but is it strange acting opposite a character that's incredibly familiar? Completely. Do you kind of want to stop and go, oh, hello. Yeah, completely, yeah. no, completely. <laughs> and, like, sitting in the Rovers, and, you know, you've got Craig Charles there, and you've got, you've got Sue Nichols over there, and, you, and, you, and you're like, that's Ken Barlow. You know, that's you're Ken just like, telly. It's just weird. I love yeah, that. It's weird. But, because but, I tended to try not, not to um, read the other characters' scripts, because I, I want to watch the show. I know. <laughs> so I just look, look at my bits and, and leave there so I can you actually watch it. didn't want to ruin the it. No, exactly. Uh, let's talk a little bit about Thomas Tank Engine, though, because you, uh, you, you have a hugely important role. Yeah. Uh, perhaps the pinnacle of your career in terms of, of, of prestige, I would oh, Absolutely, say. yeah. Well, it's such an iconic character. And, again, we've all grown up with him, so... To, to be asked to, to be the storyteller for Thomas was... Uh, I have to... I still kick myself now. 